It's beer o'clock on Reload Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Sweetwater Brewing Company and it's a kind of the going coastal IPA with pineapple coming in at 6.1% ABV. There's a look at the can. American craft beer and I so, I so dearly miss American craft beer. It's been a week or two since I've reviewed my last American craft beer. Let's get this can out into a glass and see what we get. Nice bit of smoke on the can opening, beer in the glass then. Look at that. The perfect pour. I'm a big fan of Sweetwater Brewing Company. I think their beers are absolutely ter terrific. I'm looking forward to seeing what this pineapple is it pineapple flavour? Is it real pineapple? We will, we will find out. But first of all, I'd like to thank our channel sponsors, beersofeurope.co.uk for sponsoring today's video. Uh, beers of Europe, we've got a tremendous range of beers from all around the world. Uh, America, UK, Germany, France, Belgium, uh, Norway, Sweden, Denmark, Mexico, Japan, Australia, you name it. You name the countries, they generally got a beer from that country. So check out the link in the description box of the video for beersofeurope.co.uk and on with the review. So we had a three finger white head. It's an unfiltered, hazy looking beer. That looks tremendous. Good levels of carbonation rising up the glass. Light amber color with a haze. Aroma. Yeah. It smells good. Pineapple, biscuit malt, breadiness. A little bit of grapefruit from the from the hops added in the beer. Yeah, it smells really good. Let's dive in. Cheers, everybody. It's nice. It's very nice. There's a lot going on. There's a lot going on in this beer. And um, before I do a Stone the Crows, I just want to have one or two more tastes. Just to reset. Just to, just to slowly ease myself into the beer. Reset my palate. Bro. Pardon me. I like it, I do. The pineapple, I think is pineapple. I, th I think it's pineapple, I really do. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stick my neck out and say, because you've, you've all seen my recent beer reviews. Um, I made a video of a, our craft brewers ripping off um, their, their, their customers by I know some brewers have been at it. They've been saying kind of pink grapefruits and pink lemonade and all that kind of stuff. Um, I, I, I can more or less tell that they'd add in just syrup. They'd add in, because I've brewed beer myself. I've brewed beer with, with, with big regional brewers. And I know when it comes to, uh, yeah, let's brew. Let's brew a IPA with grapefruit, with pink grapefruit. Um, you get to that stage of the process and your jaw drops to the floor because they just add in ice cream flavours to the beer. Uh, ice cream concentrates they call them and you're kind of like ah oh, no man what are you doing I, I didn't get into craft beer for this I really didn't get into craft beer for this um, but I, I, I'm gonna stick my neck out and I'm gonna say Sweetwater Brewing Company have added pineapple 
to this beer. It, it's it's very organic tasting. It's it's it took two tastes to, to to as I mentioned, trying to reset my palate, trying to re re just to give it a fair crack of the whip, I suppose, like in good old Indiana Jones. There's some nice grapefruit flavours coming from the hops. A little bit of orange peel, fleshy blood orange. So there's a good amount of hops added to the beer, which is, which is tremendous. Uh, and then you get this, this nice pineapple flavour coming through. The biscuit malt is coming through. Yeah, I, every time I taste, taste the beer, it, it's convincing me more that they've used pineapple in the beer. And I know I seem a little hesitant in, in the review because I want to make sure I'm not shouting screaming stone the crows I, I, I need to make sure just for you guys because I think it's important when it's it's pink grapefruit or it's or it's 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 pineapple or it's or it's something added you you need to make sure don't you so pardon me let's read the side of the can uh, slip into something sunshine. I agree with that for a start. Uh, and step off the grid by going coastal with this pineapple laced IPA. There you go. Uh, the bright aromas of the five citrus hop additions are accentuated by the tropical fruit of the pineapple. And just like these three days weekends, its finish is quick. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean, I yeah, I understand the three-day weekend. Yeah, I do. I mean, yeah, totally understand it. Um, <laughs> I'm, I'm a big fan of this company. I, I'm a real big fan. I only tried... I've heard of their beers for five, six, seven, eight years. Only found their... What did I find? I think I found their classic IPA in one of the Brewdog bars in Cardiff. Back end of 2017, uh, put the review up on YouTube. Uh, I've since reviewed two more of their beers, and yeah, I'm a big fan. I, I like I like this whole stepping off the grid thing. I like to kick off the sanders. I like the I like the 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 don't bother going to work stance that they have. Not not don't bother going to work, but but here we go. Cash in a sick day and grab another. You know, it's like. Hop hash, that was a hop hash IPA or pale ale or whatever it was, and there was another one. But I, I just like the, the lean back um, attitude towards life because we're all in our box soon enough. We're all we're all soon enough dead, and and this day and age, you can work. I mean, here's me talking. Yeah, you can you can you can work six seven days a week, and. And then, what do you achieve at the end of it? What do you get from the end of it? Nothing. You just get Simon Martin went to school for free. For free. Got enough, well enough educated to pay enough tax throughout his life to pay the schooling back. Their tax, they did that, that schooling, and more. And more, and and um, and I think there's a certain amount of people in life who understand where I'm coming from. They they understand. Like, like I I think if I spoke to the the owner of Sweetwater Brewing Company, I think he would understand where I'm coming from. Um, step off the grid. Yeah, I understand that. Totally understand it. Uh, going coastal by Sweetwater Brewing Company, an IPA with pineapple. Let's rate it. I like this beer enough to give it a, a 9 out of 10. It's a Stone the Crows 9 out of 10. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom! And cheers.